nice to see you again. So today we're continuing on with the dance. We've just finished the chorus and we're looking forward to teaching you some new movements. So let's now just be aware of the space we have to dance. Check out what's around you. Make sure if you're dancing with any neighbors, you have plenty of room. And the movements in this section are actually movements we've already learned. We're going to put together some pieces of the puzzle from movements we've learned in previous videos. The first one we're going to practice again is this twisting action we did off the top, where we twist to the right, we twist to the left, and then our arms make a circle in the space. Try that again, twist left, twist right, and circle in the space. Good, two more times, twist and twist. Big circle and down and twist and twist big circle and release. Yeah, now that we've practiced that step a couple of times, I hope that you're starting to really feel how there's a sense of pulse in your body. So we pulse, we pulse, we suspend and we fall. We pulse, we pulse, we suspend and we fall. So there should be a nice rhythm and quality of movement in our upper body. So we're going to connect that step with another one we've practiced before, which is the one where our palms flip up and our palms flip down. Flip up, flip down. Just try that again, flip up. Again, we're getting a rhythm going in our body. It's not just our arms moving, there's a pulse. Find the beat in your legs or in your spine or in your hands and up and down and up and down. Yes, very good. And if you're using your feet, you can decide as you step forward and back whether you'd like it to be a small step or a deep bend. Okay, both are okay. You feel what's a good challenge for you today as you're moving. So just like before, we get to do two sets of that movement. Try that with me. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight, going high and down. Second time and down. From there, you do your beautiful reach up, reach out, reach up, reach out. Great, and it's important while we're doing these big reaches that we're also finding our stability. So if you're sitting on the chair, make sure your sitting bones are really nice and connected. If you're up on your feet and dancing with me, uh, I want you to think about the ways that you're going to shift your weight. So. In this section, if you watch my legs, I'm going to give you a couple options. The, if you go up, when you go up, you can rise up onto the balls of your feet, or you can just stretch your knees and leave your feet planted into the floor. As you go side, you can take a simple step to the side and come in, or you can do what we call a chasse and really glide out. And you'll see I take in a big shift and my back foot is even being left off the floor and come in. So it's absolutely up to you how you want to explore your connection to your chair or your connection to the floor, ensuring that you're giving yourself safe challenges and that you're really feeling comfortable with your stability as you explore. So let's try this movement together and you decide for yourself how you're going to use the space with your legs and arms. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight. Going up and down and up and down, reaching. You can rise if you like or not. The choice is yours. And again, going up and down, going up and down, reaching high, reach and press and reach and press. Good, very nice, excellent. You've remembered those movements really nicely. So those are the two new parts of our phrase today. The twists we do four times, and then this section where we do two sets of the hands and two sets of the reaches. From there, we're going to go into a repeat of the chorus, which is the material we learned last time. So how about we count through the new material for this section, nice and slow, and then I'm going to try to connect that material to the chorus that comes next. Okay, but to start, let's just do the new movements with Sharice and I from the start. Find your sitting bones planted or your feet planted, and we're ready to start with our right twist. 
Ready, set, and here we go. Right and left and round and down. Other side goes left and right. Big reach and release. Again, one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven, eight, and switch. Find the pulse and up. Stepping forward or arms up one and two and up and down. Reaching, go up and reach and up and reach. And again, go up and down and up and down and lifting and reaching and lifting. Good and reach. Excellent. Bravo. If you want to repeat that and practice it again, just rewind and try it a few times more with us. But for now, we are going to try and connect that into the chorus movement. So if you remember, the chorus movement goes back, two, three, four, five, six, shape, seven, breathe, eight. Find the floor, find the ceiling, wave your left, wave your right. Stepping one, two, three, one, two, three, arms up. Four, four, counts, arms pulse. Do that again. Now, one, two, three, four. Ready, shape on seven, breathe on eight. Find the floor, find the ceiling, and breathe, and breathe. And one, two, three, and a one, two, three. Going up, two, three, four, hustling down, six, seven, and eight. Really nice work, everyone. That was excellent. So let's try this. We'll do the section we added on today into the two repeats of the chorus. First with counts, and then we'll try each of those with the music. All right, so give yourself a shake out. Make sure you're ready for lots of movement. Find your beginning place or your beginning seat, and let's try together. Ready, set. Here we go. One, three, five, six, seven, eight. And switch. And switch. And around and down you go. Again, switch. And switch. And up. Place and place. Good. Now we're going into hands flipping up. Flip up and down. Flip up and down. Reach up and away reach up and away and flip up and down flip up and down reaching up and away reaching up and away chorus goes one two three four five six shape seven breathe eight find the floor and the ceiling do a breath and a breath high one two three in one, two, three, up, one, two, three, pulse it down. Ready to repeat the chorus going one, two, three, five, six, shape, seven, and going down. And up. left arm goes up and up, grabbing high. One, two, three pulses. Bring it in, press it up, plant yourself, and pulse down in six and seven and eight. Excellent, that is a lot of dancing. You did that really well. So now let's try that first part, the new part with the music. Okay, so the new material we practiced today with the music. Here we go. Ready, set, off we go. And up, find that pulse. Really listening to the music. And breathe. All right, hands up, eyes up. Reaching. Really great work, everyone. Remember, if you want to practice that, please rewind and repeat as much as you like. 
So now let's try to put that movement together with our second repeat of the chorus. All right, off we go. All right, first pulse to the right. Ready, go. How about we move away from all the hollow Breathe in. I know we could try and make it worth a while again. All right, reaching up. Flip it up. We Flip. Go to the ocean. Reach. One more time reaching. This time we're going to keep going into the chorus. Arms back. Down and up. Left. High. And low. Push it up. Pulse it down. Starting again. Push it up and pulse it down. Excellent work today, everyone. As always, Sharice and I love dancing with you. In our next video, which is the last video where you'll learn new material, we're going to take you through the ending of the dance and then connect all the pieces of the puzzle so that you'll be ready to practice the complete choreography for our 2021 season. So from myself and from Cherise, thank you so much and see you again next time. Bye for now.